Welcome back to another episode. There's not gonna be as much content in this video because I'm waiting on a chuck to be made for this. That'll hopefully be done by next week. For now though, I thought I'd do just a couple little things that I've been wanting to do. This handle was made for me by Bryson from Science Made Funner. He 3D printed this, molded it, and then cast it out of aluminum cans. If you wanna see how Bryson cast this part, the link is down in the description, so go check that out. This handle is gonna go right there for the cross slide, so that'll be a nice addition for that. My plan for making this tool holder stronger is to beef up the center bolt. And how I'm gonna do that is this guy right here. This is a tie rod off of a truck. It's got about two inches of thread on it. So that'll work perfectly. That'll give us about an inch of movement up and down. On the one that I have on the lathe, there's a bolt on the bottom and a bolt on the top. The bolt on the bottom's welded and you tighten the bolt on the top to stop this tool holder from moving. That way you can move it at any point, stop it at any point. This one though, it already has a tightening bolt. What I can do is I can just twist it to wherever I want, tighten this bolt up, and Bob's your uncle. I'm gonna chop this off here, chop this off here. This gets welded to the bottom of the tool holder. Let's get started. beefed up, it's a lot more stable, it's more the correct height, it's cutting amazingly well, this is just a little piece of aluminum here. I ordered some tools online, they should be here next week. So next week's video, hopefully will be the last video on this. It depends on when the chuck gets finished. That's gonna be it for this video. Another video will be coming out next week, so be sure to subscribe for that. If you're enjoying this build, be sure to leave a like and share this video with your friends. Thanks for watching.